my god, this is so odd. Uh... Ah, you burnt the coffee. You really deserve this trip. This is just so insane to me. I did not expect this. Stewie's glasses fell in the ocean. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. This is... Hi, Stances. My name is Dan. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the world, world of Extra. And my name is Siwi. Oh my god, it's finally time to leave Japan. <laughs> we are finally on our way to the airport to take an international flight. You guys have probably guessed already. It is Siwi's first time leaving Japan since he moved eight years ago. So this is wild. We're so excited. We're running a little bit late, but these are the things we're bringing with us. Let's go get to the Skyliner to go to Narita Airport. Let's go! Ow! Oh my god, <laughs> We are on the train right now. We are so tired. I don't know what happened. We ended up sleeping at like 3 a.m. somehow. We really have to work on our sleeping schedule during this trip. Like this is about like relaxation and just like unwinding and sleeping a lot, eating a lot, having a lot of fun and really just, you know, no stress. Stewie just recently finished his finals and he's just so, so stressed. Stewie literally cried last night. From all the stress. Yeah, so like you really deserve this trip. And yeah. I think we both deserve it too. Thank you for taking me on this trip. Of course. And like it's wild because like we haven't been sleeping a lot and we've been relying on this drink This is for when you're really tired And I feel like I drink at least one of it every single day from the convenience store and this morning as well We had one. We also went to get breakfast with my boy <laughs> Just like a nice quick little breakfast. But yeah, we've just been rushing. We're a little bit late Our flight is at 2 40. It's currently noon. We should be there already. But I guess it's fine We're used to traveling. At least I am. If you're here, we'll be fine. Passenger princess The skylight the yellow line. This guy. I love taking the Skyliner. It is the expensive choice, but it's also the fastest choice to go to Narita Airport. I love her. She's my favorite train, honestly. Ah, I'm so excited. I love Skyliner because they have like bathroom. Oh shit. My god. How am I supposed to How am I supposed to pee like this? <laughs> We have made it to the airport. There's actually a lot of people today. Today is a Thursday, but the airport is really busy. I think people are getting more comfortable to travel after COVID, and that's why a lot of people are at the airport now. Stevie, how are you feeling? I'm so excited. <laughs> it's not like fully hitting me that we're actually leaving the country. Also, I am so, so tired. The coffee I drank earlier is just making me so tired. But everything will be fine. Okay, so we just checked in. We found Bikku Kamera here, and we always have to, you know, restock on our film camera. It's so wild here because you can only buy one. I honestly don't know how much cash I'm supposed to take. A lot of the places in the Philippines don't really accept cards. Like for example, the taxis and stuff. So I have to bring some yen here so I can just go to like a foreign exchange place in the Philippines. But yeah, I just brought like $500 with me. I hope that's enough. Shut up. Okay guys, it's time to go through the gates. The most stressful part of any travels. But Japan, it's fine. I feel like LAX is the only stressful place to go through the gate. That was actually really stress-free. Our gate is 91 and you know how traveling works. You always have to go see if your gate exists before you can even like do anything that's how it works and then you can finally relax and be like okay let me go get some food i'm so excited we're through oh the gates god. oh my god step one completed oh my god should we just fucking chanel it up oh, chanel it up. oh my god i didn't expect anyone to say hi to me at the airport what's your name saya saya and yuka from mongolia right yeah yeah thank you so much for saying hi It exists! Okay, now I can finally eat and relax. <laughs> Wait, what flavor is this? Mm, COVID-19. <laughs> <laughs> there was a Starbucks next to the gate, but you know me. I am a man of my words, and I said no more Starbucks. So I am going to Fasola Cafe, or whatever the fuck this is. I've never had it, and we're gonna rate their coffee as usual. Let's go to be my coffee connoisseur. Ice coffee no M of Tatsude. Okay, so we got our coffee. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> we also got a chocolate waffle and a normal fucking waffle. Why am I giving a review of this place? This is so random. What the <laughs> fuck is this random ass cafe? Anyway. <laughs> okay, let's try the waffle, I guess. Oh my god, how fucking cool. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. It smells so eggy and creamy. Is it good? Let's try mine. It's like the best waffle I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> oh my god. The coffee tastes a little bit burnt. Ah, you burnt the coffee. Learn how to make a coffee. The coffee, 3 out of 10. Waffle from a bag, 10 out of 10, honestly. This is the best waffle I've ever had in my whole life. So true. Oh. We're supposed to board the plane at 1.40. It is currently still... 
we're finally boarding. You guys, I shouldn't have had that coffee. It's literally making me so, so tired. Like, I'm crashing by the second. I feel like I'm literally withering away. Oh my god. And Sui and I are smart asses, decided to do TikTok dances while we waited for an hour for the plane to arrive. And I literally just used the last bit of my energy. Like, oh, I am shit. so insanely exhausted. But the flight is only about five hours. Oh my god. Wait, that's a lot. Well, time to sleep. And also, because I didn't want to buy Stewie a business class ticket, I just got economy for both of us. <laughs> We're finally taking off. Can you guys hear us? Hello? Hi? It's time for some food, which is one of my favorite things during a flight, honestly, because it's so exciting to know what's coming up. So today, the choices were fish or beef. And of course, you have to get the beef. Come on. So this is our meal. Okay, let's do a little taste test of the food. I think Philippine Airlines has good food generally. <gasps> Philippine Airlines, where are we going? And of course, even on the plane, salad back first. Salad first. It's just a regular like cabbage, onion, and sesame dressing salad. They also have chicken in the beef set. Ooh. Why is it cold? <laughs> I think this is kombu. It's like a wrap seaweed. I was actually expecting like a Filipino dish, but this whole thing is like very Japanese. Yeah. Right? This is literally just gyudon. Wait, that's actually really good. Okay, Filipino Airlines is really good food. And for dessert, they have this nice little moon cake. And fruit. And for the drink, let me just down this white wine. Who's trying to get blasted on the plate? <laughs> <laughs> Later. Finally getting off the plane. We just landed. Oh my god, Stewie. Initial thoughts. What are your initial thoughts? I don't know, like, I feel like so many, like, memories are suddenly flooding back and it's like... <laughs> oh my god, is it overwhelming? <laughs> In a very, very good, fun, happy way. Okay, that's good. Oh my god, you guys. We are exiting the airport. We got all our things and we are finally entering Cebu. Also, we are the literal last people to exit. What the fuck? <laughs> Stewie, are you excited to go out of the airport? Like, in into the country. Into the country. Oh my god, I see it. <laughs> I see Nicolette. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hi, Dad. How are you? I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the I love her. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so wild. This is just so wild that Stuvia and I are back in the Philippines together. Also, yes, I do sound different. Thank you, sir. Love you. Okay, step one is go to the hotel to check in. Let's go. Oh my god, we're here. Oh my god, this is so nostalgic. Oh my god, dude. I've never been here. We got our keys to our room. Oh my god, I'm so excited. We have a different room from last time. There's gonna be like three beds apparently this time because there's three of us. Yay. Yeah. Who's I'm Nicolette. Look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, this is so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is crazy. Are you? This is wild. What? Oh my god. This is crazy! Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god! Wow! Thank you, Jake Park! What the fuck? Ooh! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the biggest room, by the way. I wanna show you guys the view at night. <gasps> This is our view for like the next week. Oh my god. It's literally the top floor of J Park. That is wild. Whoa. Whoa. Of course, the first meal we're gonna have in the Philippines is Jollibee! Stewie, are you excited? I'm so excited. I have not eaten Jollibee in like eight years. Yeah, literally. And like when we were here, we took it for granted. Like we don't care about Jollibee, right? Not to be like an ignorant little rat, but everything is so cheap. Like we always forget how cheap the Philippines is every time we come. Like a full meal with chicken, burger, steak, spaghetti, rice, drink is 200 pesos, which is like 400, 500 yen. 
Sanders. Also, don't tell me to eat salad first because they don't have salad here. I'm so excited to be back in the Philippines with people I love. I'm just so excited to just, you know, relax and unwind at the resort. The food is here. This is massive. You guys are not ready for this. This is literally everything. Everything, everywhere, all at once. And of course, I got myself the hot dog as well. I'm just gonna be a pig. And I got myself peach mango pie and the fries as well. This is like the most massive meal. Just for today, no salad first. <laughs> The Jalbi fries are actually so, so good. They're like paler than McDonald's fries, but they're so much saltier, I think. I the rice that. wrapped in paper. This is so Filipino coated. The iconic Filipino spaghetti, sweet with red hot dogs. That's the icon. Unsa ni basurahan? Oh my god. When I lived here, I used to hate the spaghetti because it was so sweet. And I was like, why is spaghetti so sweet? It's so good. Just don't think it's Italian food. Mm, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my Mom. god. The memories. Burger steak with rice. Oh my god. This is wild. We sound like such foreigners. We're like, this is wild that it's just junk food. Mm. I I swear, Filipino food is like one of the best cuisines in the world. Do you agree living here? No. <laughs> if anything, I don't care about Japanese food. Japanese food is so boring. Except for sushi. I love sushi. Here guys, have a bite. Oh my god, we just beasted the whole meal. This mango pie is the star of the show. This is hotter than the sun, so be careful. <laughs> Cheers! Cheers! Anyway, that's it for tonight's dinner! Good morning, Siri. Good morning. Oh my god, I can't wait. Look, I can't <laughs> wait to just be here all day and just relax and get a mango drink. So, the buffet breakfast closes at 10 a.m. and it's a little bit late because it's currently 9 15. I hope they still have a lot of food. But I remember last time I came here, I was so fucked up drunk. Nicolette and I came back to our hotel room at like 6 a.m. and we were like, oh my god, we're gonna have to get breakfast so early in the morning. And we ended up coming at like 9 45. They still have so much food and we just like feasted a whole meal. And it was fine. <laughs> but everyone is so, so nice here. Like they say, good morning, sir. Good morning, ma'am. Like it's just so much interaction. Not like Japan, like everyone's kind of cold in Tokyo, right? I mean, like, of course, they say, like, but that's more like customer service. Here, you really feel the warmth of the people. It's either they're genuine or they don't give a fuck here. Oh. <laughs> we made it to the breakfast buffet. Even though it's literally almost closing time, there's still so many people. These are all the late birds. Late birds still catches the worm here because they still have so much food. I'm actually kind of chugged. Stewie was like, should I get sushi? This is day one. Don't get Japanese food. We literally just landed from Japan like 12 hours ago. <laughs> oh my god, let's just get the fattest Filipino breakfast. <laughs> I love that they keep it very international here, but we really don't care about this fucking international food. All I want are these Filipino dishes, like... I don't think that's Filipino. Yeah, it literally says Moroccan pork. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, I want some ganador as well. They don't have the red hot tops today. I'm so excited. I love buffets. Oh my god, the Filipino food section over there. Wait, give me that fucking cinnamon toast. That cinnamon toast, the last time I came, I was obsessed with it. And they would only have it in some days, and they won't have it in others. Okay, time for some soup. Literally so fucking yummy. We need to bring some of these food back to the table because this is wild. Good morning, everyone. Even in the Philippines, we do have to curate our own salad because what? Salad first all the time. So I'm just gonna add some lettuce. Salad first. Oh my god, Filipino tomatoes. Pinkari. That's our salad. It's time for breakfast. Salad first. <laughs> Let's 
literally the most simple breakfast, but also the best. I'm so, so excited good. to just have this every single day. Me too. <laughs> okay, before we go back to our rooms and get ready for the day, we have a mission. Two missions, actually. Mission number one is to change our yen to Tesla. And mission number two is get swimwear because we literally don't have anything to swim in. So let's go do that. We are changing this bill. And I've actually shook a day change rate recently. Yen is so weak. Yeah. <laughs> 10,000 yen used to be like half yeah. when you convert it to peso. So like 10,000 would be like 5,000 pesos. But recently it's been so low. It's only like 3,500. That is crazy. Like yen has been so weak recently. So like if you earn money in Japan, it's so much harder to like travel overseas, especially in the US. But look at Filipino money. If you compare, like Japanese money is so boring. Like, this is what Japanese money looks like. Look at Filipino money. It's so colorful. I miss that. I miss it too. <laughs> Can I? It. Oh my god. It's so cute. My favorite part about J Park Resort is you literally never have to leave this place to do everything. Like you just saw, we can do the money exchange here as well. There's also a bunch of like places to buy things like this for like souvenirs and even like swimwear. So that's what we're trying to get today. I need a wallet. <laughs> I'm so excited to see it. Short. Ooh. Ooh. Wait. I like this one. I like that one. Too. I love how tiny it is. That's what we love. Yeah. Tiny little slutty shorts. Oh, sorry. This is perfect. Here are the choices. Black, white, or baby pink. Wait, there's no lining for... Wait, this isn't even for swimming. There's no lining. Is that okay? Like, you can literally see my dick print. This is wild. Like, you will literally... Oh my god, it's like one piece of cloth. We just got fake Nike shorts. <laughs> Loves it. Okay, so we're back at the hotel room. But before we try out our new swimming shorts from Nike, we are going to do 50 push-ups because what matters to gay people more than looks? <laughs> <laughs> so we just did like a very natural beach makeup, just concealer and blush and of course gloss. <laughs> okay, do we get the muscle pump? Can you see it, you guys? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Time to try. This is like one leg. <laughs> this is children's. Oh my. Okay, let's go! <laughs> Before we go to the pool and the beach, I just wanted to show you guys what they did for me and like actually check it out. This is just so insane to me. I did not expect this. Look at that. They made like a little welcome note. They also did like recommended activities around the area. And the dried mango? Stop! This is crazy. And they also got me this premium dried mango with chocolate. I really want this right now actually. Wait, you know what this would be perfect with? Oh my god, Stewie. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> you guys, we are truly living this fantasy. We are just little apple boys. We've just been so annoying, like strutting and stuff. Let's turn it up. Let's turn it up. Okay. <laughs> turn up. Turn up.
You guys, it finally happened. It finally <laughs> happened. Stewie's glasses fell in the ocean when we were on our jet ski. And I was like, wow! And I hit my face on the fucking handle of the fucking jet ski. And I was like, wait. Anyway, tonight we are gonna go out, so we are gonna get ready. Yeah, and we're gonna go buy new glasses. Okay, let's get ready. Yeah. We're ready. It's time for a night out. It's a Friday. We're gonna get new glasses for Stewie, and we're also gonna go get dinner and go clubbing. I can't bring this big camera, so you guys are gonna have to stay home and go to bed, okay? Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> okay, last night was a little bit too crazy. I'm having my little beauty routine. I look insane. <laughs> but the adventure continues, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna be vlogging my whole trip for like the next two months. I'm gonna be visiting a lot of countries. I'm gonna be visiting five places. So I hope you guys are enjoying so far. Thank you so much for watching. I'm so, so happy that I get to enjoy my life like this while making a living out of it. I generally don't feel like I'm working, of course, because this is my hobby. But at the same time, it's because of you guys that I'm able to live the life I live. So thank you so so much with that said. I'm going to see you guys on my next video next week. Bye